Usually when you think of fishing, you think about relaxing good times, fun, or just enjoyment in the hope that you will have a nice catch. People all over the world are obsessed with fishing in the same way they are with hunting. However, you never know what you might catch, especially when you are fishing in unknown waters or sometimes something crazy might happen during a fishing trip. I have gathered a few examples of shocking moments that could happen during fishing. This video takes place in the Gulf of Mexico. The fishermen had a fun time fishing on the boat and plus they were drugged up at the time high on LSD according to the uploader of the video. They had a good catch. For a few minutes they were trying to pull the catch on board. When they were ready to pull it up a shark came out of nowhere and attacked their fish. I also noticed a small bloody scratch on the shark. I wonder if the fisherman scratched it while trying to shoo the shark away. Whoever scratched it definitely didn't expect this area to be full of sharks. As you can see, a few more sharks joined the dinner toward the end of the video. That's pretty cool. He's in pieces now. This Russian fisherman caught a seal in his fishing net. Seals are very cute looking animals, but they are extremely dangerous. There are a lot of attacks reported when seals attack people on the beach. So on the video, the fisherman tries to release the seal. When one of the fishermen was not able to run away fast enough, the seal bit his hand and swung him onto the floor of the ship with extreme force. Then their dog got way too close to the seal and almost got ripped apart. The dog actually bit the seal before the seal was able to react and chase the dog. At the end, the fishermen were able to push the seal back in the water by spraying it with the high pressure water from the fire hose. This next video went viral on the internet. I'm not sure what the name of this fish is, but it got caught in a fishing net. When the fisherman tried to pull it out, he wasn't careful enough and the fish swallowed his hand and arm. No matter what the fisherman tried to do in order to remove his hand, the fish just wouldn't let him. At some point, they decided to put a piece of wood into the mouth of the fish and try to pry its mouth open. After numerous tries, and with the help of other fishermen, they were able to release his hand from the fish's mouth. This occurrence takes place in Africa. The fishermen were traveling on a boat heading to a location so that they could spend a great time fishing. Suddenly they saw a hippopotamus heading towards them. It was quite far away, but in a matter of a few seconds it appeared right on top of them and almost bit their boat. It was just a matter of a few inches before the hippo could have turned the boat upside down. 
and I'm pretty sure it would have ripped the fishermen apart if it had reached the boat. Swordfish are large, highly migratory, predatory fish characterized by a long flat bill that re resembles a sword, thus their name. Swordfish are vigorous, powerful fighters. When hooked or harpooned, they have been known to dive so quickly that they have impaled their swords into the ocean bottom up to their eyes. Although no unprovoked attacks on humans have been reported, swordfish can be very dangerous when harpooned. They have run their swords through the planking of small boats when hurt. In 2015, a Hawaiian fisherman was killed by a swordfish after attempting to spear the animal. On this next video, a swordfish suddenly flies into the water where the fisherman was standing just a second ago. The swordfish's appearance was so sudden that the other fishermen even fell off the back of the boat when the fish jumped inside their boat. This next video is just pure bad luck for this poor dog. The dog ran down to the pond to drink some water. It seems like it saw the crocodile but didn't run away. Luckily, the crocodile's jaws missed the dog by an inch. This next video is a brutal mess. First a shark attacked the catch and bit off the back fin of a fish, causing all the water to turn red with blood. Then it came back and continues to bite the fish piece by piece. Then more sharks came in and joined the first shark for dinner. At the very end, it seems like one shark bites the head off a fish on the fishing line and started to go deeper into the water, causing the fishing reel to spin. Look at that motherfucker, that's huge! There it is. Oh, oh. He's just shaking the hell out of me. You just hooked a shark. Yep. Oh, shit. <laughs> he ate it all the way. 